Here he is, my lady. Gabu, it's been too long. I'm afraid there's been no change. If he can see or hear us, he has given no sign. I see. You're still fighting. I'm proud of you. We promised that we would come and visit you together, didn't we? Alphano and I. I'm sorry that we haven't managed that yet. You know, with the three of us like this, does it not remind you of that night? Of the stars beyond count twinkling in the heavens? I was feeling pretty low back then. Powerless. But I knew that my brother was close by if I needed him, and that the others would be waiting for me back at the Rising Stones. Not like now. I've seen my share of trouble since coming to Eorzea. Been reminded again and again of my limitations, of how little I can change about this world. And I've come to know the sorrow of parting all too well. But to have the people I hold dear struck down before my eyes and be powerless to help them, that, that I cannot bear. No, I don't, you're right. It's pure arrogance to imagine I can solve everything by myself. You'd think I'd have learned that by now. Thank you. I don't know what I'd do without you. Well, that's more than enough brooding for one day. Come on. We have friends to save.
The Populares no longer present an obstacle. Now is the time to bring the Empire's might to bear. A word from your radiance is all it takes. But one word, and the Imperial Army will fall upon Alamigo as a pack of bloodthirsty wolves and tear that feeble nation apart. Have you no words for me? Despite the lengths I go to, an emissary playing the part of a fool. When first I took this face, I swore to use all of my knowledge, all of my power, to further the cause of the Empire. My deeds stand testament to my commitment. And with this adamant flesh at my disposal, I could destroy the Icon Slayer as easily as one might swat a fly. Why do you hesitate? <sighs> Our enemy is resourceful. Though victory is certain now, it will not remain so indefinitely. Deliberate if you must, but be quick about it. We will speak again when you have unburdened yourself of doubt. Until then, I take my leave. Father. should be the one to sigh. I played my part to perfection. I had earned my rest, and then, thanks to La Habrea's crowning act of idiocy, our favorite emissary sees fit to summon me back. Elidibus was ever a warrior, a most tiresome trait, would you not agree? What? Have you no words for me either? No matter. I've long grown weary of this mummery. Now, my dearest grandson, let me remind you of your place in the simplest of terms. You do not make judgments, you administer them. Swiftly and to the letter. Naught else is your concern. Elidibus may be an insufferable bore, but he is no fool. His choices as emissary seldom err. If aught threatens the balance twixt light and dark, it falls to you to remove it. Be it by your own hands or by your armies, you have ample means at your disposal. That is why this empire exists, why I built it! Oh dear, have I touched a nerve? 
You always were an easy one to read. I pity you, I do. As they say, ignorance is bliss. And I know how much happier you would be not knowing the things you know. The Founding Father was an Assian, and he created the Empire solely for the purpose of sowing the seeds of chaos. Don't take it personally. I merely do my duty. To bring about a calamity requires no small amount of power, and there is no surer way to obtain such power than by collecting powerful pawns. To that end, I have labored long and hard and I must say I am quite pleased with my handiwork, paltry though it seems in comparison to Alec. You fiends are over fond of your own voices. Mark me, Asian. Man is the master of his own destiny. <sighs> Such a waste of time and energy, both yours and mine. Lest you forget you are Emperor now. If you wish to spout drivel about man's destiny, save it for the masses. It will serve to give them a sense of purpose and you pliant pieces for the game. Oh, do stop sulking, boy. You of all people should understand. Ours is a struggle to restore both mankind and the world to their rightful state. Viewed thus, our goals are one and the same.